and we will take a few moments for our children's message. Now, I don't know if you know this or not, but, but I was once a teacher, a math teacher and a computer teacher, but particularly being a math teacher, uh, that I learned and I tried to teach my students that you had to follow exactly the right pattern, you had to do the right thing in the right order, otherwise you would get the wrong answer. And that's why, that's why teachers, uh, math teachers specifically, uh, want you to write out the things that you do, the process that you go through, so that you can figure out where you went wrong. You know, in math, you do one little thing wrong at the beginning, and everything else is wrong the whole way. Now that's kind of how it is with our lives. If we do one little thing wrong, it makes us completely wrong. It's not like we're mostly good, it's the wrong answer. So I want you to know that, that as we try to be right, it's not about what we do, it's that God makes us right. It's like taking a wrong math answer and God gives us the right answer. So always try to be right, but know that God gives you the rightness through Jesus. Let's take a moment and pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for sending Jesus into our lives to make us right, to make us, to make us right with you, and to make us right so that we can be with you forever. Help us to follow you and follow your guidance so that we can do the right thing in the end. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.